Hi guys, Giant King here. Okay, so today I'm going to do a little video. Uh, basically, my tips and advice on how to be really ripped and really healthy and be an extremely hardcore gamer. Because if you know me, you know all I want to do in my free time is play games and that's all I do do in my free time. Okay, uh, so all my life I've always been healthy. I've never ever at one point been unhealthy I've always been in very good shape uh, don't be it's nothing to do with the fact I'm army PTI or I'm a, a personal trainer as well it's nothing to do with that all my life beforehand I've always been in shape and it's been so easy it's unbelievable and I am the least active person ever I am so lazy it's unbelievable I I I've been on leave now since 13th of December and now it's like what the the 6th of February and I do nothing apart from sit on my PC and and play PC games yet yeah, I'm in the best shape ever okay so obviously I'll show you a little video uh, of me so you know I'm not bullshitting so you can see what I'm actually like Okay, so tips, how to get ripped, either putting on muscle or getting rid of body fat and that, and it's so simple, it's so unbelievably simple that you, you wonder how you ever got out of shape anyway. Okay, so basically the main issue is what you eat, right? That is the 80% cause of why you're currently at where you are. So this is very much what you're drinking what you're eating okay so let's start off sat there hardcore gaming you know i'm playing whatever hours and hours and hours and hours and hours because that's that's what i do i'm really hardcore okay so all i drink is water yeah all i drink is water and green teas or herbal teas okay so you have like your green tea and so forth because that speeds up your metabolism in fact I'll show you one I'm randomly having. I'm just having these these green teas because green tea and I've got Herbalife Herbal Tea as well. But these green teas, you know, they, they speed up your metabolism. They're good for fat burning and so forth. And they're a healthier option, right? Uh, snacking, avoid everything. Like, it's so common sense. If you, if you avoid, you know, all your crisp chocolate sweets, and replace them with either fruit or you know I, I have protein bars and and fruit that's what I have for my snacks but if you can have tuna or whatever it's just it's not cutting things out it's just replacing them with something decent all right Cause remember this is 80% of how you are is because of what you're eating all right unless you got some medical reason all right uh, your main meals okay let's have a think about it don't have fry ups in the morning and don't skip breakfast in the morning have something that's you know got complex carbs and protein so like i don't know like some eggs and uh, you know uh, por porridge oats uh, what's the oats so simple there you go that's what i used to have all the time it was oats so simple uh, or so something decent like that so if you can have pro protein and complex carbs or something like that it's very good for you you, you, you lunch think about it don't just be grabbing some random shit try try and actually have a structured day of meals and snacks because you need both as a male you need 2500 calories so think about what you're intaking and then structure it all right so snacks if you if you do not buy crisp chocolate sweets and that it's not going to be there for temptation like biscuits and that it's just just a packet of shit you might as well just eat, eat someone's shit you know it's just complete crap going into your body that is going nowhere so it's just sat there and and building all right so if you can avoid buying that you're not gonna have the temptation of it being there all right so that's very much a very important part that's the 80 percent all right if you can obviously smoking and drinking that's more than common sense if you cut your drinking down uh, that's gonna help not put the excess body fat on and help you getting uh, fit and toned okay 
exercise. Like I say, I am the least active person. I am extremely lazy, but I force myself to go to the gym. You know, I'm on solid leave. Yeah, I, I wake up at like like two in the afternoon. Yeah, I can't be asked, but I, I go, right? I, I go because I know end of the day, I'd be happy that I've gone. You know, it could be like eight, eight at night. I'll be like, I really, really can't be asked. Yeah, I proper can't be asked. And I'm like that every single day. I still need to go to the gym today. It's half six. I'll go after this video. You know, so even when you can't be asked, just go, right? Go and then make the most of it when you're there. All right? So when you go to the gym, actually have some kind of structure. Do something so you're not wasting your time at the gym. So have something like, you know, you're going to do just your biceps today or you're just going to do some t you know, Tabata today or you're going to do your legs. You know, don't go there and just do everything. Yeah, that's stupid. Just, unless you're doing a proper, it's actually a proper sesh uh, that's uh, very well constructed. But if not, se uh, separate it. You know, you do your shoulders that day. You'll do your chest that day. You'll do your back that day. You'll do your legs. You know, do something like that. Okay, so training wise, the best ways to burn body fat is first is high intensity interval training, second is like heavy weights, yeah? You, you don't, the people you see with the best bodies are the ones who do a lot of weights and a lot of weights properly. They're the ones that you see with the best bodies, not the people that go to the gym and spend an hour on the treadmill, yeah? They don't have nice bodies, they've just got fucking nothing really, they've got no definition, nothing decent. People with the best bodies, females and males, are the ones that do weights. Yeah, they're the ones that have the ripped, athletic, nice-looking bodies. All right, so that's what you want to do. You always want to go and do. For me, I hate cardio. Cardio is so damn boring. So me, I just go do weights. Uh, as you can see again in um, a few more clips of me. Uh, obviously, this is what I look like. Right. Uh, so I do know what I'm talking about because obviously I've been doing it for years. Uh, with you know, and it's my job as well to advise uh, and help. Okay, so basically, if you want to sit and play your games all day, because that's what I want to do all day, and that's pretty much what I do do all day, you know. Uh, but you don't want to get unhealthy, uh, fat. Yeah, you know, there's no just because you're a gamer doesn't mean you need to be skinny. Doesn't mean you need to be fat. Right. There's literally no excuse. You know, it's very simple. I only train 30 minutes a day in the gym, five times a week. That's that's it. That's all I do. Uh, so if you can go three times, minimal three times, you uh, change what you're eating, drink more water. You'll change your body so well, better, healthier, happier lifestyle. Yeah. Uh, so that's my little tips in how to be ripped you'll be surprised how quick your body changes when you change your nutrition All right so that's my tips on how to be ripped as a gamer uh, to be a hardcore gamer to do fuck all else and just sit and play games changing your nutrition doing a bit of training phew, you'll change your body really surprisingly well okay so hopefully this helps you know you don't need to change your life too much it's just a tiny bit to ask uh, but it's it's helping you in the long run, right? So hopefully you like this video. So give me a like, subscribe, a thumbs up, obviously, uh, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, it's John King. I'll see you guys later.